Okay, madam, I have just gone through your file. I was sent by the optometrist. So I'm just going to conduct a brief test on you if you don't mind. That's all right, it's, uh, it's called a confrontational test. So just relax, okay? <laughs> no problem, huh? Let's just see. Face me like this. Uh, now, can you use your left hand to... Uh, yeah, like that. Yeah. Open these eyes. Okay, that is it. What do you see? One finger. Okay. What do you see? One finger. Okay. What do you see? One finger. How about now? One finger. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> switch hands. Use your right hand to cover your right eye. What do you see? One finger. Okay. What do you see? Um, two fingers. Mm. What do you see? Um, f four fingers. How about now? F four fingers. Mm, okay. That's fine. It's all right. Uh, you just hold on. <clears throat> um, doctor, I hope my sight will be corrected. Uh, no, right, it's fine. It's, it's all right. Uh, Okay, um, uh, madam, what I just did now is called the confrontation test. But um, I would still need to conduct a more in-depth test on you, which is um, just called the retinal tomography. I would have to go to the lab for that so um, I can properly diagnose what the issue is. Okay, doctor. Uh, relax, everything will be fine. I assure you of that. Okay? I pray so. Shall we proceed to the lab? Yes, that's beautiful. Okay. <laughs> hey. Yeah, baby, I'm here, right in front of your house. In front of the place you stay. Yeah. I missed you too. Oh, How are you? I'm fine, as you can see. Oh, you're not looking bad. You too. You look <laughs> great. Thank you. Thank you. You are looking. Mm -hmm. so, I'm enjoying, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's been long, bro. Baby, I've missed you a lot. Are you so, sure you missed me? Why? Hmm? I miss you. You that I've been enjoying. You've been enjoying it with your husband and you left me to suffer. Why are you saying that? You don't have to say that. I cannot abandon you. You know it. Are you yeah? sure? I can never leave you to suffer. I care so much about you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Okay. So, now you're here. Where are we headed? What of the place you are coming out from? Uh, no, no, I don't like that place. It's not nice and it's mm. overpopulated. Okay. Yeah, and okay. the, too much noise there. Yeah. Okay. You, you said you would take me out for shopping. You buy me new clothes the last yes, time. Yes, so that reminds me. First and foremost, I have to go and spoil my baby boy. Mm? Then from there, we head to somewhere. All right, we'll go to that five star hotel. Okay. So I will massage you Aye, so well. I cannot wait. And take you to Cloud Nine. Where you going? 
Fuck you, no, finish what. <laughs> That's my boy. Yes, yes. I love that. So it's been three weeks think, now. Yeah. So let me let me drive you. I think mm-hmm. yeah. you know how I drive it, mm, yeah. so I can be touching you, yes. romancing That's you. That's my boy. <laughs> I love you. I love you more. Thank you. Let's go. Let's mm-hmm. let me go and spoil your little. The way you used to do it. And do your little. You know, eh? No <laughs> man can handle it the way. No man can do it. Have you? you like the wife? Yes, everything. <laughs> <laughs> I come back from work, but I meet him at home. I really miss you. I missed you too. <laughs> you see, all this while that you are not around. In fact, mm, I know. I was not getting myself. Your husband I cannot know. do it better than I do. Ah, uh, mm. you trust now. No, I go. You know that man. Ba, ba, ba. Full, yes, full of stories. Mm-hmm. Once it's time for action, we will start. You will start me sleeping. How the aeroplane? In mm-hmm. fact, I miss you. Mm. I miss you, my baby. I cannot do it. Uh-uh. Jesus, it's like who is in your house? I think he's my husband. Your husband? Yes. What do you mean, your husband? I finished. Your work. What do you mean, your husband? Jesus. You don't understand. Stop asking too much questions. I just thought you told me that he traveled. I never knew that he will come back. Hey! Ah! I'm finished. Please, please. How please. will I leave this place now? Ah. Baby, you have to go. You have to go. Hey! You know the type of person he is. Please. He's go. a military man. What if what if he has pistol or gun with him? I mean, how am I going to leave this place please, now? There's no time for questioning. How do I live here? That's the problem. Please, wear your clothes, please. You have to. Oh my God. You... I told you. I told I know. I see if I knew. I told you. Don't stay in the hotel. Why are you complaining? You are complaining. It's not good. Where you? Put on your... Hey! Beautiful steps. It's like it's close. Where am I going yo, yo, to yo, go you now? Where am I going to go now? Oh my God. I don't know. It's finished. Too. Uh, oh. You cannot hide there. Get up. Where will I go to now? Come. You have to jump through the balcony. Jump? Please, it's like you don't get this I'm man. Full steps. It's like they're close. Please. I'm finished. Let me take my Take, take, take. With you. I mean, this, this is midnight for crying out loud. Guy, I beg, come open the gate for me. It's too like talk. 
I should come. Hello? Look at this boy. He disconnected the phone. What is wrong with him? Chicken, huh? what is wrong with you? What is your problem? What do you mean? Do you realize that we are not the only tenants that stay in this compound? Look at the time that you're coming back. Bro, it's not my fault. So whose fault is it? Chicken, why? Why? Why are you limping? Come on. It's a long story, yo. I went to see my sugar mommy. And she wanted me to sleep over. Lo and behold, the husband came back from travel. I had to jump from the story building. And then I had fraction. Why are you laughing? <laughs> you think it's funny? That's what you get, Mr. Gigolo. <laughs> hey, don't, don't, don't. Don't, don't you ever call me that again. I've told you not to call me Jigolo. Well, that is what you are, isn't it? I mean, women pay you for sex, don't they? Is it my fault? Is it my fault that women find me attractive? Unlike you that have this ugly scar on your face. Please excuse me. You did not have to mock me, Chiki. You didn't have to. No boy water for me. Yes, baby. Sugar baby. <laughs> oh, you're back? Oh, really? What about your daughter? We agreed you will leave her in Abuja to stay with her aunt. Okay, uh, that's all right. Uh, not really. She's, she's not a threat. We can actually do whatever we want to do. Yes. <laughs> of course, I love you so much, baby. I'm free. I'm free. I'm not doing anything. You bought gifts for me? Wow, I love gifts. What did you buy? When I come? All right, I will come. I will come around. What time? Okay, I will come. Yes. So, um, baby, what about the money I told you? I, you know, I, I need some money to fix something. I told you, right? Okay, when I come, right? I love you more, baby. I love you. <laughs> you know, now when I come, I'll start from you. <laughs> Bye. All right. Yo, what's up? I suppose. That is one of your sugar mummies, huh? Um, that was Patricia. You remember the rich lady I told you I met at the mall the other day? Yes, I do. Yeah, she's back in town. She wants to see me. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's obvious she misses you much. Misses me. Come off it, bro. That lady just wants me to come and shine her cobwebs. Nothing more. If I go there now, she wants me to knock her. Do you know that five times is not enough for her? Five rounds, I will knock her one hour later, she wants again. Every hour she wants me more. I'm tired. The only thing I'm enjoying from that woman is the money she gives me. Oh, you called for it. You have to satisfy her sexual urges and she pays you handsomely for the trust. No, I'm tired, Joe. I'm tired. It's just the money I'm enjoying. Well, enough about me. What's up with you now? Your supposed girlfriend, how far? How did it go? Mm -hmm. uh, who else? Sandra, of course. Oh. Have she accepted you? When are you guys having your first date? When is she coming to the house? Sandra. Yes. <sighs> well, she... <clears throat> she says I'm not her type. <clears throat> Really? Oh. oh. Sorry about that. Well, my friend, you are a hardworking man, very responsible. You're doing fine for yourself. I mean, you go to work. I don't know why guests are not taking you seriously. <laughs> A good heart, yes. But 
this. <laughs> I literally scare women away. Can you imagine the last lady who agreed to make out with me? She had to do it blindfolded with her eyes closed. <laughs> that was very disdainful. It's not funny at all. There's nothing to laugh about. <laughs> it's funny. I am tired. Honestly, Chike. I am so tired. So I have decided to remain single. No, and no, Just no, to concentrate no. on making money. Listen. That is my aim now. Listen, <clears throat> listen to me, my friend. You see, I'm into women. I know how this thing works. Mm -hmm. You need to have a lady by your side. Mm -hmm. Not anymore. No, no, no. I you... have decided to remain single. That's what I want to do from now on. You know, I, I do not want any unnecessary drama. Hmm? Yeah. But, um, but listen, you should keep trying. Okay, Chike, or can I help you get one? Don't worry, Chiki, I would be on my way to the office now. <clears throat> okay. And um, make sure you don't come back late. Or else you sleep outside. Mr. Jigolo. Mad man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, I'll drive okay. safely, okay? Yes. What <laughs> uh, is this? Hello, sugar. It's me. How are you, my princess? Good. You okay? Yes. Do you want anything? No, I'm fine. Okay. <laughs> um, you came back alone? Yes, I'm I'm alone. Ah. Okay. I thought I had I heard you talking to someone. Oh, I, I was on the phone. Just hold on a minute. No. Hello? Yes, yes, I just got home. Yes. Um, can I call you back later? Okay. <laughs> All right. Bye. Not not on the phone. Like I heard it, someone else's voice. No, no, no. It, it was a phone. Oh. Okay. Uh, you you mm. sure you don't want anything? Mm -mm. Okay. You 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 changed your color. Uh yes, I just discovered this new one. I liked the fragrance. It's very spicy. Uh. I decided to try it. Okay. Mm. Just that it smells like a man's color, but it's okay. No, no, it's it's mine. I just thought, you, do you like it? Mm, it's not bad. <laughs> yes, um, I'll go upstairs and freshen up. Okay. You okay. sure you don't want anything? No, I'm alright. Alright, darling, I'll come back soon. Thank you. Okay. Mommy. Mom. Yes, dear. You say you came alone. Yes, I did. Yes. Just so I hear footsteps. I'm just going to change and come back, okay? Mm. She, she says she's alone. <laughs> but it seems I'm hearing footsteps. And it doesn't seem like just one person's footstep. It's alright. Baby. Baby. Why are blind people so inquisitive? Um, because they are blind, they are extra sensitive. Besides, the colon, I think it triggered the too many questions. I don't think so. You know what I think? Mm -hmm. The romantic laughter before we enter the living room. The romantic laughter? I didn't uh -huh. know we were laughing romantic. 
It was too much. Where we? Where we? Mm. Where we? <laughs> but please, babe, please. Let her not do this again. Whenever I'm here, I want to enjoy myself with my woman. I don't want anybody to start disturbing me or start looking. Straight to business, right? You know it. <laughs> okay, so guess what? I got something for you. Really? Yes. Should I close my eyes? You don't have to. Okay. You should be, you should be used to me by now. Alright. Alright, here you go. Wow. Baby, are you serious? Mm -hmm. Wait, wait. All this for me? All that for you. Wow. And also, <laughs> better watch you. <laughs> Come. Oh my goodness, <laughs> babe! <laughs> Mom! Oh. Um, are you okay? I'm fine. Yeah. Yes. It's just that um, I heard you laughing uncontrollably. Uh, I was on the phone. <laughs> oh. Yes. <laughs> I'm fine. She. Should I come stay? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, go back downstairs. I'll be. I'll just dress up and come downstairs. All right. All right. Mm. All right. <laughs> Is she gone? She's gone. Are you sure? Yes. Mm. Hey, hold, hold on. She came out all by herself. I told you. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> She's gone. She's gone, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sweet woman. <laughs> Yes, come in. Hey, man. Hey. What's up? You care for a drink? Sure. Good. What's going on? You're crying. I'm tired. Of, I'm tired of being blind. I just wish I 
I will just die and end this miserable life. How can you say such a thing? If anything happens to you, how do I survive? Mom, it's easy for you to say. Because you're not the one wearing this shoe. Listen, I might not know exactly what you're going through, but at least I feel your pain too. Please be patient. I want to see your face again. I want to see my friend Bella. It's okay. I want to be able to move around without Shh. just imagining things. It's okay. It's okay. I know how difficult this is for you. But honestly, I appreciate you. Even with your condition, I'm glad to have you in my life. Now don't lose your faith in God. Nothing is impossible with God. For how many years? I've been praying and wishing. I don't even think God still exists. Don't say that. Don't compromise your faith. You have to keep hope alive. And I'm telling you, one day he's going to reach out and touch you. Say amen. Amen. It's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so your birthday is coming up. What would you wish for? Just say it, anything you want. Still the same wish every year. Me too. To regain my sight. Everything will be fine. Okay. All right. No, stop, stop. Stop, don't do this. You're too beautiful to shed the tears. Okay. Hmm? Everything I like. Uh Leo. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry about this scar on your face. Mm. You know. It's okay. Honestly it is. And thank you for this. <clears throat> I actually needed something to distract me. Um, Leo, mm -hmm. I honestly want to thank you for everything mm -hmm. you've done for me. Mm -hmm. Ever since I lost my parents, your parents took me in. And from that day, you have been like a brother to me. I know you are wondering why I am thanking you. I am not drunk. <laughs> I just want to thank you for always watching my back. Hey, no homo, but I love you, bro. You should know that. I love you too, bro. Thank you. And honestly, you need to stop thanking me, okay? Let's just enjoy the drink. Pour me another glass. Mm. Let's enjoy ourselves, mm. right? Mm. So, um, so, bro, let's make a toast. Yes. A toast to our friendship. Mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Our brotherhood. Brotherhood for life. Because you're my brother. Yes. <laughs> hey, don't break my class. <laughs> Easy, bro. That's enough. You're such a weak man. Mm -hmm. That reminds me, Chiki. Yeah. How do you manage to still get an erection when you're sleeping randomly with, I mean, so many women? Mm. It comes natural, bro. Wow. Wow, you're a stallion. I'm a star boy. Mm -hmm. Bella, do, do you really have to go? You know my birthday is in two days. You know I've been planning for this trip for so long. My sister and her new baby needs me. 
I know, but you should at least stay for my birthday. After my birthday, then you can go. You know, I've never celebrated my birthday without you. I know. But I can't cancel. I already told my sister I'll be leaving the city tomorrow. All right. Um. So how long are you going to be away for? Let's say a month. A month? One that's month. that's a long time. But that's okay. All right, ladies, lunch is ready. Okay, ma'am. Mm. Food is ready. Yes, let's go. My room, fix my room. Oh, what room? I fixed the room now. I have to rush to work. I, I, you know the one who brought who brought the drinks. Which drinks drink? here. Which drink? Which room? Drink. Oh. Oh, leave me a bag. Leave me a bag. Let's oh, rest now. Oh. Wake up! Ah! Don't I fire you guys? Oh, nothing was rest well. Madam, how are you doing today? Much better, Doctor. And the family? They are pretty well. Beautiful. Beautiful. So basically, what you're experiencing with your left eye is a refractive error called astigmatism. Uh, that is what is responsible for your distorted vision. But... Um, <clears throat> These prescription glasses should help correct that. Thank you so much, doctor. Yeah. And one more thing. Um, make sure you avoid exposure to bright light because it's too sensitive for the eyes. I will try as much as possible to do that. All right, madam. I have to attend to other patients. Have a great day, madam. Thank you so much, doctor. I beg to take my leave. Okay. Thank you. Take good care of yourself. I will. All right, madam. Uh, today is supposed to be your daughter's birthday, right? Mm hmm Why do you ask? I mean, I'm just, I'm surprised. I'm wondering why you asked me to meet you here. You should be spending time with your daughter. I mean, today is a big day. 
She's an adult. Besides, I missed you. You know how much I like spending time with you, don't you? What? What's with the look? Oh, you don't like the fact that I chose you instead? I like it. Yeah, sure. Let's do that. <laughs> more life, more money. Mm. So, guess what? I'm thinking we should go on a trip. Wow, when? So, two weeks from now? Two weeks. So, where would you like to go? Dubai, um, Marrakesh? Dubai, Dubai. I want to go to Dubai. We've been to Dubai before. Let's do Marrakesh. Nice. Marrakesh. Very romantic. All right, no you problem. You love it. No problem. <laughs> Two weeks time. Two weeks. All right, uh, boy. I need to get some new clothes and shoes. You told me already. You're going to get it. Stop fretting. Mm -hmm. Are you going to send the money to me? I will. <laughs> <laughs> I missed you, baby. I missed mm. you. Mm. Mm. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you. I'm happy now. You should be. Yes. Mom. 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 She's not at home. Mom! She's not around. I mean, it's my birthday. She, she didn't even wish me a happy birthday. So frustrating. I can't do anything on my own, like at least go somewhere I want to. Be happy because it's my day. Huh? It just feels like I'm trapped. Everybody left the house today. Even the security. Harry! And it's my birthday. Madam. Henry. Madam. Henry. Oh, yes. Open the gate. Ah. Madam, no. If you open the gate, you are not say they go. I'm going out. But, eh? I know they see road now. I said I'm going out. Open the gate. 
What if Mudo can't jam me for good? It's not your concern. Just open it. Madam, no, that will pass my power. Uh, your mother if you can't sack me now if, if I open gate for you. Henry, you see if you don't open this gate now, eh? I will tell my mother you tried to rape me and you end up in jail. Ha! Jail! Is it better you open the gate or you want to go to jail? Madam, eh? I don't want to go to jail. No. Eh, so open the gate now. What's more, madam? This one what you do now. This one. This one I had to do. Eh? You know, say they go. What if something can happen to you? Just open the gate. What's more, madam? I don't open now. Oh, madam, mm -hmm. you know, say they go now. What if something can happen to you? Yeah, I'll go out. Which can well. Come on, Dad. You go fall, you. Fall me. You want to go best for me? I beg, come inside, man. I beg. This God name beg you. I don't want to lose my job. You know, say you want to go. Don't follow me. Don't follow me. Henry, do you... don't follow me. Come on, Dad. I'm going to come down so good. Come on, Dad. Oh, madam, I beg now. Come inside now. No, say you know they see good. Wait. So, madam, Henry, I beg don't now. Follow eh? Don't follow me, Henry. Oh, madam, I'm going to come now. So, which kind of problem be this now? Eh? I leave village. They still follow me. Come, come city. Which kind of be this now? So, madam. So, madam, I beg. Come inside now. This now can't big, madam. Which kind of world be this one? So, madam, I come. Are you okay? Are, are, are you all right? Uh, Did I, I hurt you? Uh, how will I be okay? Oh. Eh? You think that you're not seen properly? My nerves. I, eh? I, I, I'm so sorry. My apologies. It's not like you're the blind one here. My apologies. Why are you crossing the road on your own? Is there, is there nobody out there? To, is there no, nobody guiding you? I'm going somewhere. Oh, okay, wait, wait. Uh, where are you heading to? Can what? I can I drop you off? Drop me to where? Wherever you're heading to. Are, are you a kidnapper or something? Or a serial killer? Oh no, madam, I am I am not, none of that, okay? Uh, look, it, it would not be nice of me to leave a, a young lady in your condition out here on your own, walking. Uh, it's just best that I take you to where you're going to. Are you a kidnapper? I am not. I eh? just said that. Could you come in, please? I have somewhere I'm going. I don't want to go inside anywhere. Listen, young lady, I, I am not trying to stop you from where you're going to. I, I will want shout, to take though. you there. I will shout. Leave me. I will shout. Leave me. Do you, you, you want to shout? I'm offering to help you. I know where I'm going to. Just leave me. Uh, the car is right here, please. Hello, someone. Madam, she come out for gate. What? And you let her leave? 
Madam, I've been telling her. Are you stupid? I've been telling her. Oh. Do you realize that girl is blind? Yes, madam. And you let her leave? Madam, she said she go sack me for work. Can I make? Who calls the shot here? Madam, now you. Now really? You. Yes, madam. Whose daughter is she, yours or mine? Madam, now you. Did I not leave instructions not to let her leave this gate? Madam, no verse. And you allowed her to go? Madam, sorry, no verse. Madam, <laughs> I beg. If anything happens to that girl, if anything happens to my daughter, you will spend the rest of your life in jail. Ha! Jail! Oh. Madam, I beg, I beg. Go I'm out there and look for her now. Yes, madam. Go out and look for her! Yes, yes madam. Idiot. I don't even know how I employed you. Once again, I wish you a very, very happy birthday. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> I, I really enjoyed the, the ice cream. I'm glad that you did. You know, this is actually the the first time someone is taking me out. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, well, today's your birthday, so yeah. it should be a special day for you. You, you made it soon. Thank you so much. By the way, um, you know, you're, you're a beautiful girl, right? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yes. And you're a very nice person. Very, oh. very nice. <laughs> well, I do hope I am. <laughs> yes, you are. All right, Rosamanda, tell me. What exactly happened? How did you lose your sight? Um, it was just a little issue. And my parents have done everything in their power to make sure I regain my sight, but all have proved 
abortive. Mm. So I just have to live with it. I'm really sorry about that. It's okay. Uh, here's the thing. I'm an ophthalmologist. What that means is that I'm a skilled eye doctor. I trained in the UK. Oh. So that makes me a certified eye doctor. And I think I might be able to help. Oh, all right. That's good. <laughs> so tell me, uh, where are you heading to? What's your house address? Oh, um, 37 um, at Bakiliki Street. Bakiliki Street, okay. Jerry. Okay, we'll be there shortly. All right. Okay. Can you imagine? Eh? Since she left, we've been looking for her. Now we don't even know. I, I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know how this useless boy. I don't know. I left instructions specifically. Do not let this girl leave the gates. This idiot that I employed. He's been... I don't even know what to do. Where else? Where? Let me call you back, please. Let me call you back. Where is she? Madame. Where is my daughter? Madame, I beg, don't do this. I don't check every day. You are trying my patience. Madame. Henry, you are trying my patience. Madame. You are trying my patience. Madame. Now go back out there, wherever it is you're coming from, and do not come back to this house without my daughter. Hey, Madame, I beg, I don't check every day. I don't. Get out! Yeah. Please, don't try my patience, my friend. Hey. How do I tell the story? This hey, you can't be this one. So I can go Rose, where have you been? You got me worried. Are you okay? Mama, I'm fine. Why did you go out on your own? Good day, madam. Young man, who are you? Leo. Mommy, Leo is my friend. Yes. Your friend? Yes, and he's an eye doctor. I see. I almost ran over her with my car. I couldn't leave her out there all by herself, in her condition. So I brought her home. I see. Thank you. He's a very nice person. He took me to an ice cream shop mm. and I had a great day for my birthday. Thank you. Can yes. we go in now? All right. You take good care of yourself 
and don't go to the road on your own, okay? Okay. Right. Bye, Leo. Bye. Where is this? Henry! Come and open the gate for him. Henry! Don't worry, madam. I'll, I'll do it myself. Careful, that's it. You didn't say happy birthday to me before leaving. I had a meeting, I had to rush off. But I, I got your cake. Take care. Bye. No idea what almost happened today. Can you imagine? While I was driving, a blind lady just walked straight in the middle of the road. I almost hit her. I am telling you the truth. Who allows a blind lady to, 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 to walk on her own? Who does that? This country is a very funny one. Oh, in fact, uh, I have. Go. Oh. Yeah. Um. Yeah, Jude. Let, let's talk later. Eh? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It is fine. It's fine. I'm okay. All right, bye. Ah, Leo, what's up? Chicken. Ah, fine. You're back early. Yes, I'm back. How was work today? Well, well, work was okay. It was all right. It's fine, right? Yeah, thank God. Um, I heard you said you almost knocked the lady down today. <laughs> Chicken, lady. you have no idea what happened today. I, I was driving, uh -huh. and then a blind lady walked right to the middle of the road without anyone guiding her. Thank goodness I was focusing on the road while driving. If not, I would have hit her. What will I say? My brother, tell me, what exactly would I say if I hit her? Oh, thank God. Anyway, it also turned out that today is her birthday. So I had to take her out, you know, to buy her ice cream and make her feel more comfortable, you know. More like hold, a way hold, of apologizing. Hold on, hold on. You almost hit a blind girl today. And today is her birthday. Yes, that's and that's, you, that's what I said. You you went to buy her ice creams too. Yeah, just to compensate her and make her feel okay. Feel did you did you by any chance you know make further inquiries about her? Further inquiries, huh? Well, she told me that her name is uh, Rosamond AGK. You see a lie. And that huh? Rosamond AGK. Wait. Oh my goodness! Do you know her? Of course, I know her. That is the daughter to my. To my sugar mommy, Patricia. Are you serious? I'm serious. Ah. What's ah ah? But wait, is is she aware that you're having a relationship with her mother? Um, not really. I mean, she's blind. She's a blind girl, so she can't see. She what do you mean? She she she's a blind girl. Are, are you are you making jest of her? Are you making jest of her predicament wait, wait, because you wait, want wait. to have a, a smooth relationship with her mother? You're, you're happy she's blind? Uh, wait, wait, um, Leo, apart from the ice cream you bought for her, did you, you know, further ask her more questions? More questions? Uh, no, I didn't ask her anything. I'm just the normal, like, check up on her. Excuse me. Make sure she's me. fine. Tango, you didn't hit her. Chike. Chike, is there, is there something you're not telling me? Uh, no, 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 I'll be back. Indeed, it's a small world. <sighs> Thank goodness. <sighs>
Hello? It's me, Leo. Hey! It took you so long to call. I've been expecting your call. I'm sorry. How are you? Ah, I'm okay. You? I'm fine. So tell me, what are you doing? I was about to sleep or until I heard my phone ring. Oh, that's... I see. Uh, that means you would like to cut the call and go to sleep. No, no. We can talk. Okay. Um, I, uh, how's your mom? I'm sure she's fast asleep. <laughs> so basically, that is the theory behind that. Mm. A lot of people think it's... What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that's what I'm trying to explain. I mean, you know, most belief systems think it operates that way. I mean, just like I said, it's, it's a belief system, so it's... Hello? Uh, Rosa, are you there? Yes, she has slept. Rosa? <laughs> What's the time? Oh shit, it's 4 a.m. Ah. sleeping by this time. Leo! Are you not going to work? Wake up! Oh, Chiki, what is it? Uh? Look at the time. 8.45 a.m. already and you're still sleeping. Mm? It's what? Uh -uh. 8.45? What, what are you saying? Look at the time now. 8.45. Oh my goodness. Why this did boy. you wake me up now? You normally wake up very early in the morning. Uh, what happened today? I have missed calls on my phone. Leo, are you okay? On call for like five hours mm. with a girl you just met yesterday. What in God's name were you guys discussing for five hours? I'm, I'm even surprised. Hey. She know I made her laugh. I made her laugh before she slept. Guy, it's very <coughs> obvious that you're in love with that girl. Well, she's, she seems like a very nice girl. She seems like a very nice girl. A girl you met yesterday and you guys had to talk for five hours. Mm. Oh boy, my friend, don't fall in love. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up. I'm in the parlor, okay? Let me go um, prepare. I'm going out very soon. But um, breakfast is ready in case you need anything. Mm. Yes. All right, all right. All right, meet me up later. Eh? Rose, mom, what's going on? I noticed that you've been very excited since you woke up. Share the good news. Mm. Uh, I'm just excited about life. Hmm. Since when? Mom, stop making it look like I'm a broken record. It's obviously something getting you this excited. Tell me. I'm just happy. Great. I am happy for you. Hello, Rosamond. 
It's Leo. <laughs> of course I know it's you. Yes. I know the sound of your voice. Oh, really? <laughs> we just started talking yesterday. Ah. And you think it's not enough for me to know um, how you sound? That's impressive. Yes. Thank you. Um, I'm really sorry about yesterday, Liu. I slept off while we were talking. Yes, it was when I woke up this morning, I, I realized that I, I dozed off. <laughs> and I was able to make you laugh uncontrollably. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I've never laughed that hard before. You should always be happy. You deserve it. Thank you. Um, so, where are you? I'm at work. Oh, walk. All right, I just wanted to call to hear your voice and to see how you're doing. Ah, that's so thoughtful of you. Thank you. I'll call you later, okay? Please make sure you call like you just said. I promise. Cross my heart. Okay. I was surprised when he came to drop her off yesterday. Yes, I knew it. I knew it was him. I mean, how could I forget the scar on his face? I hope this is not a problem for us. Because my daughter must not find out about us. Don't worry, baby. Leo won't say a word to her. I hope so. I hope so. Baby, can you please send me like 400k right now? I'm in a boutique what? and I'm out of cash. Chike, I gave you money a few days ago. Come on, baby. You know money is like spirit. It finishes within a twinkle of an eye. Please, baby. Okay, okay. I'll send you something. I promise I'll make you happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what mm -hmm. I mean? <laughs> okay, that's enough. You know how to patronize me. All right. You will do it now. Yes, yes, I'll do the transfer now. All right, thank you, love. Mm. Love you. Bye. True love is when we do all that we can to make those are
Rose, you want anything? Um, no. Come, come. Is there something you wanted? Um, I am here to ask for your permission. For oh. what? I want you to come to the house tomorrow. He's coming to visit you? Yes. What's really going on between the two of you? Liam is my friend and I like talking to him too. I see. Are you falling in love with him? Falling in love? Mm-hmm. I don't even know how that feels. But you like to talk to him? Yes. I I always like to talk to Liu. Mm. And even when I'm talking to him on the phone, I don't want him to stop talking. <laughs> I noticed. Come. Come and sit. Sit with me. I think you are in love with him. Oh, is that how it feels? Well, yeah, when you love to talk to someone and when you talk to them, you're very happy that that's a feeling of love. Oh, okay. Because whenever I talk to you, he just lights up my mood. I know, it's, <laughs> it's a beautiful feeling. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Uh, so, Mom, can he drop by the house tomorrow? Yes, yes, of course. As long as it makes you happy. Yes, it will mm -hmm. make me happy. That's good. I'm Let's happy see. for you. Yes. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Is there something else you want? No. Tea? No, I'm okay. Okay, that's fine. All right, go on. Good night. Good night, my love. True love is when we do all that we can to make those around us happy, no matter what it takes. When we lay all things down to prove that we truly can beyond where eyes can reach, that is true love. True love is when we do Good day, madam. Good day, how are you? Um, please, come on. Thank you, madam. Happy, no matter what it takes When we lay all things down It's proof that we truly can Beyond where eyes can reach That is true love The true test of love is When the going is wrong The true test of love Leo, I'm here. Yeah, <laughs> I've been expecting you I know. since morning. <laughs> Sit carefully. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> All right. Um, I'll leave the two of you alone to discuss. Take care of my daughter. I will, ma'am. Thank you. Leo. Mm -hmm. Leo. Yes. Uh, I I miss you so much. 
How have you been? Well, I've been good. But we communicate over the phone, right? Yeah, we do. But, you know, it's not the same as sitting next to you. Yeah. Oh, let me help with that. <laughs> You know, I I always imagine what what you look like. Yeah. Um, ah, your hair. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you look really good. Like, you know, good people are very handsome. Like, very very handsome. <laughs> Who told you that? Yeah, of course I know. Good people are really handsome people. Yes, I know that. Like you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. You see? Oh, you wear glasses? Yes, I do. Mm, oh, it's a doctor thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Doctors wear glasses. Mm. I mean, I always imagine how handsome you look in my head. <laughs> You know, you are, you do have a, a pure heart. I mean, your heart is pure and fragile. Ah. Oh. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. And I must say, you're very beautiful. Thank you. It's been really hard to get your beautiful face out of my head. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's really nice of you. I mean... I don't always get such compliments. Yes, my, my dad used to tell me that I'm very beautiful. And then my mom and my friend Bella. <laughs> but since my dad died, mm -mm. yeah, my mom and friend would say it. But no man has ever said, you're beautiful. Well, it's, it's an awesome thing that I am the first person, aside your dad, that is telling you how beautiful you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It makes me a special person. <laughs> of course you're special. Yeah? <laughs> you're very special to me, Liu. Yes, you are. You, you know, you, I don't know if anybody has said this to you. You carry this aura of happiness. I'm always very happy whenever I'm around you. Same here. I'm always very, very happy. Extremely happy when I'm with you. <laughs> Thank you. And the truth is, I love your person very much. Ah, oh, I love your person too. <laughs> yes. Um, did my mom offer you anything to drink? Oh no, I'm I'm I'm, I'm fine. Uh, no, let me go your to company the kitchen is enough. And I'll go to the kitchen and get some. No, 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 there is no need for that. You sure? A hundred percent. Oh, okay. So. What have you been doing all day? Guy, you don't get sense, oh? Honestly, I used to think you are a wise person, but now you just confirm to me that you are nothing but a mugu. For the first time, the very first time in your life, a girl is in love with you. And here you are saying you want to make her see again. For what? Because she wants to see again. Yes. Besides, we wouldn't know if she truly loves me or not. Exactly. She's still blind. Exactly my point. She loves you now because she cannot see you. And you know it. Just let her be like that. I am not going to do that. I can't do that because I, I want her to love me. God. I, can't, I can't just fold my hands and do nothing and, and leave her to remain blind when I know I can do something to help her. She, she needs to see how... How beautiful the world is again. You don't even see how it looks like. You don't even know where I am driving at, my friend. You don't even know where I am. You don't even know what I am talking about. Okay. Eh? Fine. What if at the end of the day, this girl doesn't reciprocate your love? Eh? What will happen? You will start nagging, become sober, depressed. You want to kill yourself. This is the only opportunity you have right now. Let her be like that, my friend. I know what I am talking. It is for your own good. TK, I know that she genuinely loves me. And she would not care about my scar or, or, or how I look like. Says who? 
eh? Says who? Okay, you make her to see again now and she sees you like this and then she doesn't reciprocate your love. What will you do? Eh? Listen, my friend, I am into women, okay? I will tell you how this thing works. Normally, any girl will see you like this, no will like you. If that girl happens to see you like she will never ever like you, she will not accept you. This is the only opportunity you have for you to just embrace this thing and then let's meet. Guy, are you hearing me? I'm listening. Let this girl be, please. Chike, I know that she genuinely loves me. I know that. And I love her from the deepest fiber of my heart. That is all that matters. Okay, what if it backfires tomorrow? What will happen? Oh, don't worry about that. Don't worry, Chike. I can handle this. I'll you, be fine. No, don't, don't worry about that. <laughs> you, you can handle it. I'll be fine. Eh? There's always what you keep telling me in this house. Don't, 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 don't worry. Even if this car that affect, did it affect your hand as well? Eh? Every time, uh, uh, don't worry. Listen, if anything happens, do not complain to me. Oh. Don't ever try it. I will not listen to you. I will not listen to you. Who says? What, what, what's my business? Eh? Mom? Mm -hmm. Leo wants me to undergo another surgery for my eye. He said he's setting out. See you again. Mom? Yes, yes. Can you hear me? I, I heard you. So. Leo said he wants me to undergo another surgery. That he's certain I will see again, but all we have to do is pay seven million into uh, seven what? Million. Into the account of the hospital come he on, works. Come on, Rose. Seven million naira. Yes. To who? We're not giving him a dime. Can't you see what that young man is trying to do? He's using you. He's taking advantage of your condition. Can't you see that? Remember, when your father was alive, he took you to all the good hospitals, home and abroad. And nothing happened. What is different now? Who is he to even tell us what is possible and what is not? Mom, um, Leo studied in the UK. Yes, so he knows. Very good. He studied in the UK, so what? So what? All he wants is your money. Open your eyes and... He wants your money. We're not giving him a dime, okay? You're not going for any surgery and that is final. What now? You're not going for any surgery. Eat your food. Yes, doctor. She has been blind for a long while. Although if you asked me, I believe if the situation had been tackled on time, she would have regained her sight. Yeah, she said she's um, been to several hospitals for treatment. There's still hope. I'm sure of that there is still hope. Um, doctor, can I call you back? Okay. Uh, please come in. Madam. What are you doing in my office? Is Rosamond okay? Is she alright? Look, I don't know what's going on between you and my daughter. Whatever it is, I need you to stay away from her. I can see through you. I see your intentions for her. What is it you want? Money? How much? I beg your pardon? What was this all about? It's money you want, right? What do you think are my intentions? What do you want? Money? How Mon much is it? Money? <laughs> I don't get you. What's with the eye surgery? What makes you think that you can make her see again? Obviously money. What, cut cut your tongue? Listen to me. I see through your charade. I know guys like you. And I'm not going to sit back and watch you take advantage of my daughter. So name it. What's your price? With all due respect, madam, firstly, I am not after your money. Secondly, I am not that character that you have 
you have created in your mind. Thirdly, I do want what is best for your daughter. And I believe that with my help, she might be able to see again. Well, we do not need your help. My daughter is doing just fine. But she wants to see again. She wants to see. Why don't you do everything possible to make her wish come true? Instead of trying to stop me, why don't you put in some efforts? How did you question my love for my daughter? No, I am not questioning your love for your daughter. What I am trying to say You is have no right whatsoever to poke your nose into my family affairs. So I'm going to warn you for the last time. Please tell me what it is. How much is it you want? So you stay away from her because I can see through your charade. Mother, I know men like you. You do not understand me. I am not after your money. I, I have no ulterior motives. I am not poor as you can see. You know what? I'm going to ask you nicely for the last time. Stay away from my daughter. But if you persist, you won't like it if I come back here next time. Where is this coming from? I really don't understand her. No. Why would she just come to my office like that in the first place? No. She should be grateful to me. You should see that I am doing her a favor here. Okay, fine. I have told you before. She is just a mother and she is concerned about her daughter's well-being. That is why I tried to make her understand that I am not after her money. I don't want to dash mm. Rosamond's hopes. Fine. It's okay. I will talk to her. I will make her see some, some senses. Yes, make her see sense. All right. Mm? Make her see sense that not every man who comes into her life is after money. Okay? Okay. I am not a gold digger. I am a self-made man, a certified doctor. Okay, certified doctor. I might look like this, but I do have some dignity. Mr. Dignity, it's okay. Thank you. Uh, certified doctor. Nobody is certified doctor. Certified, certified loner. Mr. Dignity. This guy make me, I don't forget my phone inside. Yeah? You don't call my babe. But I need some cash. Certified doctor. Don't come back again, no. Bye-bye. Hello, dear. You want something? I'm trying to make some salad for us. Do you want something different? Do you want anything? Um, Mom. Leo said you were in his office yesterday. I see he already reported me to you. Pretty slick. Leo is really trying to help me. He's, he, he really cares about me. Mom? What? I'm saying that you should allow Listen, you. if you have come here to convince me, don't even bother about it. My words are irrevocable. You will not go for that surgery. But why? Can't you see I'm trying to protect you from hawks? What can Leo do for you, really? You've gone to all the hospitals. The doctors have told you what your fate is. I don't want anyone dashing your hopes. Mom. Why does it feel like maybe you don't want me to see ever again? What? Yes. How can you say such a thing? You think I'm happy you can't see? I don't know what to think again. Because why, why won't you let you do the surgery. Rosamond. Mm -hmm. How can you say this to me? It's more. That's how I feel. I, I have this strong feeling you don't want me to see. And that's why you don't want 
due to the due to surgery. This is not fair. So is that yes? Yes. I I don't know why mommy does not want me to undergo the surgery. I mean, Leo already said he would do anything within his power to make sure I regain my sight. Honestly, I can't wait to come back home and see this Leo guy. Ah, Leo is a nice person. He's God sent to me. Yes. And but the problem here is that I don't know why it's so difficult for mom to see the good in him. Yes, and sometimes I just feel that she doesn't want me to regain my sight. Come on, don't talk like that. Auntie loves you. Maybe she has her reasons. What reasons? What reasons does she have? Liu had already said he'll make sure I regain my sight. I don't know why she's not agreeing to the whole thing. I mean, God is not going to come down from above and make me regain my sight. We use humans here. Well, I think you should talk to your mom. Plead with her. I'm sure she can say no to you. Well, I'll try. But I already had that discussion with her and it didn't go well. But I'll try. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Alright. <clears throat> Rose? Rosamond. Mommy. Mom, I... The salad is ready. Mom, I... I know you're looking out for me. And you really don't want anything to go wrong. But please, let me undergo the surgery. Please. Rosamond, you said you think I'm happy that you're blind? I'm your mother. How can you say such a thing to me? Mom, I'm sorry what I said hurt you. It was a slip of the tongue and I'm really sorry. I was just worried about you. I just want the best for you. I didn't want to raise your hopes and if things don't turn out the way you expect them to, I didn't want you to get hurt, that's all. I was just looking out for you. I'm sorry. It's fine. Okay, Mom. So, Mommy, can, can you go ahead with the surgery? Okay. Okay. We're going to go through with this surgery, okay? And then we will trust God for the best. We can do the surgery now. Yes, we can. Ah. <laughs> yes, we can. Thank you. I'm so sorry if I made you think I don't want you to see. I'm so sorry. No, it's okay, Mom. Thank you so much. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Are you happy now? Yes, I'm, I'm very happy. <laughs> I'm glad to see you this happy. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So the salad is ready. Yes. You want to come now? Give me a few minutes. I'll okay. calm down. That's fine. That's okay. Thank you, mommy. She's <laughs> <sighs> finally agreed. Siri, call you. Hi, Liu. Yes, mommy said we can go ahead with the surgery. Yes, I'm happy too. I'm happy. Hello. Hi, doctor. So tell me, how is the most beautiful flower in the garden doing? 
I'm doing great. I'm very sure that you are so eager to see the world. Yes, I can't wait. All right. <laughs> You have to be very patient. In a couple of days, your vision will get much better. I can't wait to see you. <laughs> As the Scots would say, yeah. just a wee luck, okay? Mm -hmm. um, Bella is not here. No, she's not. I can't wait to see her too. I'm sure everyone will be here very soon. Yes, Bella and I have been friends for years. That's interesting. <laughs> mm, I can't see the point. Oh, yeah. yeah. Later, yeah. <laughs> I can't see the movement. But... Oh, you can see? Yeah, yeah, it's usually like that at first. Oh, okay. Yeah. But don't worry. So, how long will I stay before I can see? Well, you cannot give a definite date to it, but let's just say two weeks thereabout should be much better. Two weeks? That's 14 days. Mm -hmm. About that. It could be less, it could be more. Oh. It all depends, but I can assure you it will get better. All right. Thank you so much, Dr. Oh. Liam. I'm always going to be here for you. Mm? Thank you. I'm so grateful. I am grateful to do this. <laughs> Yeah. My sunflower. <laughs> Thank you. True love is when we do all that we can to make those around us happy, no matter what it takes. When we lay all things down. Beyond where I can reach, that is true love. Are you okay? Yes. Open your eyes. Can you see? I thought you said you could see better now. Princess? Yes, open your eyes. Can you see me? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes, I can see you. Are you sure you can see me? So. <laughs> really? Oh my God, I am so grateful to God. I'm so sorry, I didn't believe you. I just, I was just worried. I didn't, are you sure you can see me? You still look so beautiful. <laughs> You're beautiful too. I never knew a day would come that was to see your beautiful face. I'm so grateful to God for this. Ah. Oh God. Mm. Open those eyes, open them. I want to see. I want to see good. Ah. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry, uh, I'm not Leo. Princess, why don't you lie down? He's not Leo. Mm -hmm. Leo is just around the corner. Relax. Where is, where is Leo? 
He was in here a minute ago. Um, okay. Please, excuse me. Okay, that's fine. Just like that. Relax. Relax, he was around. Um, that was my PA. Yes, Leo will soon be back here. Okay. You're so beautiful. You are beautiful, my princess. I'm so happy I can see you. Again. <laughs> Grateful to God. <laughs> Thank God we took this risk. Guy, are you okay? Why did you leave the room? Okay, I, I, I'm scared. What if she doesn't like me? What if my scar chases her away? What is wrong with you? You're scared. At least go and see this girl first before you. Finally, confirm all these things you're saying to yourself. No, I, I can't see her, Chike. I can't. I, I, I love her too much. And I don't think I'll be able to take it if she rejects me. Fear of rejection. You're scared to be rejected. Hey, Leo, I never knew you as a lily livered person. You have to man up. Listen, this girl almost mistook me for you. Go and see her. Chike, I... <sighs> Leo, listen. I don't like this attitude of yours. You told me in confidence that you want this girl to see again. You want her to see the beautiful world again. Right? This is your only and last opportunity for you to see her and express your love for her. Stop acting like a baby. And then you were coming down the stairs. <laughs> the two of us tripped. Because <laughs> I was trying to hold you. You had this. <laughs> Yeah, um, Rosamond, uh, this is Leo. Hi, Rosamond. Hi. I'm Leo. <clears throat> Thank you. I'm glad that you can finally see. No thanks to you.
I said, wow. Is this you? I'm speechless. <laughs> Come on, Rose. I mean, Liu loves you so much. You know it. If it was not for that guy. I know, Bella. I know, okay? But come on. Take a look at Leo. Look at his face. And then his back. We're not even talking about just his face. Look at the back. Over time, he will eventually bend and then probably moving around with walking stick and then his face will just shrink. So I'm expected to just take him. Bella, you and I know that if I wasn't blind, I can't be with exactly. Someone. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, it goes to show you that love goes beyond looks and it's about the heart. And you know Leo is a nice guy. Admit it. He's a nice guy. I'm not disputing the fact. Okay? I appreciate everything Leo did for me. Believe me, I'll be forever grateful to Leo. But I can't. Be with him. He does not fair now. Ah. Ah, ah. Why are you talking like this? That's unfair. <laughs> he does not deserve it, trust me. Life is not fair. Okay? Bella. Please, enough about Leo and me. Let's talk about us. What should I offer you? Leave me alone, Joe. What? Leave me alone. No. You sure? <laughs> you are so excited. <laughs> <laughs> At least I'm. Are you okay? She's she's still not picking my calls. Why won't anyone love me? Why? I might look like this, but I do have a good heart. Is that not enough reason for, for someone to love me? Is that not? <laughs> I, I thought that Rosamond would be different. Um, is that why you're crying? It's okay. Relax. Relax. Just mm. take a cheap here. Mm. All right? So she's calling me. Hello? Hi, Sunflower. Right now? Okay. I'll be on my way right away. You have to excuse me, Chica. I have to go and meet up with her. If stubbornness was a person, I warned you initially. Hi. Hi, Rosa. Mm. How are you? Good. I, uh, I... I don't know what, what's going on because you've been avoiding my calls for days now. Did I do anything to offend you? No, nothing. But I've been really busy. Busy? Are you no longer interested in me? Uh, yes, I'm interested in you. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, about that, that's like, that's the major reason I called for this meeting. 
So, do you, I mean, I, we can be friends, but I don't want to have anything serious with you. Rosamond. Honestly, I, I love you. I love you so much. Y yes, like I said, we can be friends. But you're not the kind of man I want. I mean, I, I don't love you that way. So. Rosamond, please, I beg you, don't, don't do this to me. You just break my heart, please. You know, I'm really thankful for everything you've done for me, but I don't want anything serious with you. But we can be friends. Okay, that's what I said I should let you know. Rosa, All right? Rosa, please, I... Rosa! When we lay all things down To prove that we truly can Beyond where eyes can reach That is true love I've been thinking about this guy. I wish he was Leo instead. I really liked him the moment I set my eyes on him. He's the one I want. And I'm sure mom can make things possible for me since he's up here. Ah, you wanted to see me? Yeah. Is everything okay? Yes. So, Mom, how about your PA? Oh, he's fine. Yeah, I haven't seen him since that day at the hospital. Yes, yes, yes. He took a few days off. Oh. Ah. Uh, Is everything okay? Yeah. I mean, the guy's really fine. Like, dark skin and... Nice height, <laughs> nice body too. He is. Yeah. And <laughs> I like him. You do? Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Why him though? I thought you were with Leo. No. You said he's a nice guy. Leo? He has been good to you. Oh, Mom, please. Look at you now. Just look at his face, all those st stuffs on his face. So I'm supposed to go out with someone like that. Oh, Mom, please, I can do better. But Leo is not my kind of guy. Yeah. Leo is not. She lives. I mean, the way he looks, dresses, when he comes out. <laughs> yeah. I really like him, Mom. So, uh, it, is it possible for you to, you know, so we can date? <laughs> um. True love is when we do all that we can do. Those around us happy, no matter what it takes. When we lay all things down, it's proof that we truly can beyond where eyes can reach. That is true love The true test of love is when the going is rough The true test of love is when the ride is too tough
Leo. Leo, what is wrong with you? Huh? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, give me this. Don't tell me you are the one that consumed this alcohol. All alone. When did you start drinking? Guy, look at the time. This is past 10 a.m. You're still here. Are you not going to work? Leo. All right. It's okay. Fine. Uh, tell me. How was your meeting with Rosamond? How did it go? Take it, please. I beg you, please just leave me alone. Just go, I beg. I beg. I, I, I do not. I do not want to have any discussion. I'm not in the mood to have discussion with anybody. Leo, you are my friend. You Please. are more like a brother to me now. Hey, hey stop. I won't let you. No, no, no. I won't let you do this. Stop it now. When do you start drinking? Please. I don't like to see you this way. I can't leave you in this condition. Talk to me. What is bothering you? As usual. I got rejected by Rosamond. But, um, it's okay. It's okay. I totally understand how you feel. But, what are you going to do now? Okay, I am tired. It's okay. I am just so tired. I, I understand. Tired of I understand. I understand. I understand. I understand. I'm tired of rejection. I'm tired of the pain. I'm tired of okay. being depressed. I'm tired of everything. All I want you to do right now is to relax. Relax your mind. Everything will be okay. I promise you that. All right? Take it easy. Yeah, just, no, no, no. You can't. You can't do this again. You can't. Let me just so, excuse let me. me drown this pain. You see. So, so excuse me. Hello. Oh. Hello? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, um, I'll be on my way now. Yes. Okay. Listen, Leo, I, I have to go. Well, I don't want you to drink. In fact, I'm taking this bottle away. Let me recover. All right, I just want you to relax. Everything will be fine. I promise you. Huh? Yes, there's food in the kitchen. You can relax. Just don't stress yourself too much. I'll be back, okay? Can you hear me? Take care. The true test of love is when the going is rough. The true test of love. When the ride is too tough All that we give All that we sacrifice Honey, honestly speaking, I don't understand you. You mean you want me to go into a relationship with your daughter? Mm -hmm. But why? She likes you. What do you mean she likes me? Do I look like a toy that you can just push to your daughter because she likes me? Chike, for your own good, you better agree to this arrangement. <sighs> Baby, I don't understand what you're talking about. How do you mean? Okay, I think at this point I should let you in on a secret. Rosamond is not my daughter. I'm her stepmother. Her mother died while giving birth to her. Her father married me and died years later, leaving everything to her. So now you know that every penny that I have spent on you actually belongs to Rosamond. I'm only an executor of her inheritance because she went blind. And now that she can see, I want everything. 
every single property. Listen, if you get her to sign the papers, everything will belong to us. Oh, now it's getting interesting. Was that the reason you asked me to follow you to the hospital? So she could see me and like me instead of Leo, my friend? Are you in or not? has done nothing but the best for you. If we're not for him, you... Bella. I have thanked him. But if it's for this relationship, I can't. Okay? There's someone I like. Yeah, I like someone else. You what? I like someone else. Already? What do you mean already? Yes. Who is that? His name is Chiki. Chiki. Don't tell me is the uh, is the guy with the fro that I saw down. Dark skin. Yeah, that's Chiki. He's cute, right? Huh? Rose. What? Oh no. Why are you doing this? What am I doing? Okay, okay, let's put aside the fact that uh, Leo might have a scar on his face and maybe he walks somehow. Mm. You can't compare the two. I will just take a look. Chicken. He's tall, dark, pink lips. The guy is fine. I mean, you know you can't compare the two, babe. Yeah, you can't. I mean, just take a look at two. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to say. You know what I'm saying. You yes. can't compare the two. Like, Leo is a very nice man and you know it. Chicken is nice too. Say so. Me. Rose. Bella. Okay, now let's just be honest. Okay. So if they keep Chike and Leo and they ask you to pick, who are you going to pick? Be honest though. In, yeah, just be honest. <sighs> be very, very sincere. Well, my own case is different. Because you then, know what he has no, done. No, this is, I'll pick this or I'll pick that. So. <laughs> Stop laughing. <laughs> You that I know, pick. I'll pick Leo. <laughs> I'll pick Leo. That is hunchback like And then his hand is like this. No, but for real. I want to touch you. It's, it's different with me. Hold on, don't wait. wait, wait it's it's different with me. Just hold on, take it to come in. See, baby, I want to kiss your hand. Then go on. <laughs> Oh, 
lives around us happy, no matter what it takes. When we lay all things down to prove that we truly can, beyond where eyes can reach. That is true love. True love is when we do all that we can. Yes, I'm, I'm home already. All right. Of course, I'll call you back. Talk to you. She good. Yeah, for now. What is going on between you two? I don't understand. Do not pretend like you do not know what I am talking about. I saw you two together holding hands and walking down the road like lovebirds. <laughs> Do you love her? I don't know what you're talking about. Do not take me for a fool, TK! Answer me! What is going on between Rosamond and you? You want to know? Do you really want to know? Well, we are dating. Yeah, she's my girlfriend now. She lost me. How, how could you? How, how could you do this to me, TK? I thought we were brothers, and you know. You know how much I love that girl. Uh, well, it's not my fault. She finds me attractive. It's not, is it my fault? Should I say no to her because, because of you? That's not possible. So these words are coming out of your mouth. Tike, you can open your mouth and vomit those words yeah. when you are the cause of my predicament. Yeah, yeah. You are the reason I'm in this condition. The problem I have with you is that you like shouting and nagging. All right, just bad luck. Alex, stop. Get out of my house! Out! Out of my house! Get out! Get out of my house! Out! Okay, okay, fine. Get out! Fine. Get out! Get out! It's okay. It's okay. Fine. No problem. I will leave. But I will leave you with this. I am not the cause of your predicament. And I don't want to ever hear this from you again. Excuse me. Come in. Come in. Rose. Oh, mom. Welcome. 
I just saw TK out there and he says you asked him to stay. Oh yeah. What's with him staying over? He said he's having misunderstanding with his friend Liu and he sent him out of the house. So I told him he can stay till he gets a place. Really? You didn't think to consult with me first? Mom, I'm sorry. I didn't tell you. I just wanted to confirm. Sorry. So what happened between you and Leo? He found out that I was having an affair with your daughter. And? He asked me to leave his house. That's fine. It's good that you're here. That way we can plan and execute without hitches. Mm -hmm. Are yeah. you hungry? I'm hungry. For you. Hmm. I've missed you. <laughs> missed you too. <laughs> oh. I'm a pro when it comes to this. What? Psycho? Psycho? I need star. <laughs> cross. Someone is angry. Oh. Cross. I have cross. Big two. Hold on, last card. What's that? Hold on, last card. What? I'm about to check, check it. Check. I'm about to check. Check now. Should I check? Yes. Should check. I check? Yes, check. Let me pity you. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew you didn't have anything to do. Let me pity you. There you go. All right. Chike, I need you to take me somewhere right now. Ah, oh, mom, no. Oh. What do you mean, no? Why don't you use the driver? He's my PA. I need him now. Mom, no, mom, that's why the driver is there. To take you around. We're playing game. Okay, so... And... Yeah. Yes. So you know, who's playing now? It's my turn to play. Your turn? This belongs to you. Okay. Yep. Let me allow you to check. Okay, I need. Sorry, I barged in on you. I actually went to your office and they said that you're on leave. So I had to ask them for your house address. Liu, why are you doing this to yourself? You have to start leaving. I am very sure that love will find you again. You should blame it on your friend. <laughs> She left me for my best friend, Chike. What do you mean by that? <clears throat> Chike is my best friend and her mother's sugar boy. Silly. He's nothing but a gigolo. What, what are you... Give me this. What are you saying? You don't realize what you're saying. That chicken is what? 
Mm. Yes. And that is the man that Rosamond left me for. Leo, are you sure of what you're saying? You don't just throw accusations like that. Are you sure? Look, he does not love her. I am the one who truly loves her. But she left me. She left me. So what are we going to do now? Because obviously he's in it for money. <laughs> what else? Of course, it's, it's because of the money. He doesn't care about anything else. All he cares about is money. Money. <laughs> That's all Chike cares about. You're sure this document is well articulated? Uh, well, you can count on my expertise. Okay. 
I'll do the next one. Thank you so much. Where did you get this information from? There are no false information. Babe, Chike is not who you think he is. He's your mom's boy toy. Did you ever stop to think why he moved into your house? It's because Leo sent him out of the house. Chike is Leo's best friend. And Leo had to send him out when he discovered that you guys were going out. Leo? Yes, Leo. I see. So, Bella, you give you this false information and you blindly believed him? Why would he lie? He has no reason to lie now. Babe, you have to believe me. Bella, can't you see that... This guy is just desperate. I mean, this is just his way of ruining whatever it is going on between Chiki and I. The guy is not just ugly, he's manipulative. Can't you see it? When did you become this insensitive and rude? Have you always been like this? Bella, Chiki is my mom's PA, okay? Mozo, if you care so much about Leo, why can't you just go be with him? Yes. Rosun said I didn't tell you. Babe, I just want what's best Bella, for you. Bella, Bella, you know what? I think I just have to go. Alright? Um, Rose. Rose. Rose! I'm um, Rose! Baby! Baby! Yeah, baby. Okay, so. It's time. Okay. You need to go now and get her to sign the papers. Like, right now. Um. Okay, uh, baby, I've been I've been thinking about what you know. I want it to be a smooth one, so I came up with this idea. Like, I want to drug her. You know, do make whatever. Her high. Listen, listen. I don't care what you want to do. Okay. Do whatever you need to do. Get her to sign the papers. That's all. All right. All right. All right. All right. It's fine. But how did you? How, how do you see the idea? I don't care. Okay. Just go ahead and do this thing. Let's just be sure that we're settled. Have you have you seen her? I haven't seen her. Check your love next. All right. Um, honey, I've been meaning to ask you this question. Do you really hate this girl so much? Are you crazy? I don't hate her. I'm not just her mother. I want what rightfully belongs to me. Listen, I told you this before. I'm just going to say it again. Don't ask me again. Okay. I'm not her mother. Her mother died while giving birth to her. Her stupid father marries me. I love them. I love. I took care of her. But then the man dies and then leaves nothing to me. Gives everything to her. Where does that leave me? Yeah. Where? I see. So I'm trying to get what rightfully belongs to me. We need the money. Do we? So go get the work done. Yeah, that money is very important. <sighs> now. Baby, come on. Take a cheap pill. Don't worry. I got you covered. I will do it. But before that, why not we have a quickie? Are you kidding me? Hey, get the hell out of here. Go and Babe, do this thing. I and... miss you. I promise you I will do it. Can you just stop? This is not the time. Baby, come on. Okay, okay. Get her to sign the papers. This is all ours. We have Time, she will sign it. Don't worry. Trust me. <laughs> can you can you not do this, please? Yeah. 
Shit. Shit. I warned you. This is bad. Oh, God. What should we do? Rosamond. Mom, why are you doing this? Why am I doing what? Just open the door so we can go. No. Open the door. Why are you doing this? I thought you loved me. Stop it! I thought you're my mother. I'm not your mother. You heard that already. So open the door and let's talk. But you raised me. I raised you, so what? I raise you and then your, your stupid father dies and gives you everything, leaving me with nothing. Listen, I don't want to make any trouble and I'm not going to hurt you. Open the door so we can talk. Rosamond! Uh, Rose, can you just open the door, please? Open the door! I just want you to sign the papers and I would leave. Nobody gets hurt. Now open this door before I lose my mind. Open the door before I break it down! What? Break the damn door! What are you talking about? She's not going to open. Break the door! Please, 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 you need to come now. Please, come with the pins. Please, come now. You're going to force me to break the door. You. You. I told you to open the door. I told you I wasn't going to harm you, but now look what you're making me do. So I told you, just sign the papers and it's all over. Me, strangle just, her. Let me just kill her. Just, just strangle her. What are you doing? What are you doing, my friend? Look what you made me do! Mom! Look what you made me do! Chike! 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 Is it Chike, it? baby, please don't do this! Chike! Chike! Chike. has cataracts so we'll be um we'll be using a laser surgery to try and see how we can fix it yes uh, we also want to yeah. rosamond i'm really sorry Leo. i'm sorry for everything I've realized that it's not all about how one looks, but their hearts. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I. I was I. I love you. You should know that I... 
I love you very much. And I'm sorry that... I'm sorry I look this way. No. You don't have to apologize for the way you look. You didn't do this to yourself. Okay? I've accepted you the way you are. And I love you, Liu. I really do. It's just that I had expectations. But I love you for your heart. And I'm sincerely sorry. My sweet sunflower. I love you too. I love you so much. 